Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I have Many Allergies November 2020 box, which this month is a snow day. So we have, per use, we've got two polishes. The first one is Frigid B354, and this one is a thermal. And then this one is Fleece B355. And this one is described as a champagne metallic. Oh, sorry, I didn't describe Frigid. Frigid uh, color changing cream stamping polish. It changes from blue to purple, it says. So this is the cold state blue. And then when it gets warm, it changes to purple. So after I do my swatch stick we'll get some warm water and play with it and on to our plates so the first one is 043 MXM 043 we've got two snow globes one on each side We've got a poinsettia, a pine cone, some candy canes, candles, a gingerbread, a deer, a reindeer. We have these ornaments, and we have this, which you can stamp a solid color and then stamp the ornaments over. So that's a layered stamp. Or these snowflakes to the right, they are also made to layer over this. So you can either do the ornaments or the snowflakes. We've got this snowflake, an ornament, present, bells, Santa hat. I'm not sure what kind of animal that is. I'll have to stamp it and see because my old eyes can't really tell. Then down here we have gingerbread men with cute little faces you can put on them. And then they can either be wearing a Santa hat or a bow tie or a scarf. We've got naughty or nice. Uh, Dear Santa, just bring wine. Have a jolly Christmas. Dear Santa, I've been good-ish. And then we have reindeer with little reindeer faces that you can put on them. And a little Christmas tree and a little Christmas wreath. And then our next plate is MXM044. And then we have abstract Christmas trees. That looks like it could be snowflakes. Happy holidays. Not sure what that design could be, if it's meant to be anything or not. Uh, poinsettias and maybe snowflakes. And then we have our uh, fancy snowflakes. And then we have our reindeer and Santa sleigh. And it says we're Santa. And then Christmas lights. And... They're not doing gummies yet, and I think people have said that um, we had enough of the old stickers. So this month, they sent one of their new stickers, and I love this one. It's so cute. You say Stamping Addict like it's a bad thing, and it, it's a decent size sticker. So that's going to go on my large toolbox that I keep a lot of my supplies in. Now, our extra this month are these gold studs. In various shapes and sizes. A um, little disappointed they don't come in a resealable bag, so I'm going to have to get some little containers to put them in after I open it. But it says the shapes are hearts, stars, diamonds, squares, teardrops, and marquees. So I already have a couple of swatch sticks so that I can swatch these colors. Let's get you zoomed in some. So the first one's going to be Frigid. They really should be opaque enough to get you through one coat. Okay. And that is Frigid, the thermal. The 
And next we're going to do fleece, which is the champagne color. Again, I'm only going to do one. This one does not look as opaque as the cream. So I'm not really sure how well it's going to stamp, although metallics usually do stamp well. going to stamp with my Dixie Plate Slice Plate, Lace 01, in this image. Stamps beautifully on the white. The black, mm, it's difficult to tell, but I am going to top coat that one as well. Let's see what that looks like. Oops, sorry, hit my camera. This one's a metallic, so you might have to stamp quicker because they have a habit of drying quickly quicker than creams do of course beautiful over the white the black mm, depending on how the light hits it it does look good and light but um, low light you probably won't be able to notice it that much So it does show up better over the black once you top coat it. Let's look at the champagne. Mm hmm that one's pretty. And I say champagne because it's champagne colored. That's not the name of it. It's fleece. Fleece and frigid. All right, so I'm back and I got some warm water and some cold water, and we're gonna play with the thermal, the frigid. So this is in the cold state. And now let's see what it looks like in the warm state. Ooh. That is definitely a pink. There it is cold and warm and then let's see if we can do half and half. Cold and warm. Let's see what the description says the warm is. It says from blue to purple. I'm sorry. That looks more pink to me than purple. I mean, the cold state to me looks blurple, and the warm state to me looks pink. Would y'all say that's pink or purple? Where's, let me get, let me get something white. So would y'all call that pink or would you call that purple? I mean that looks purple to pink to me. So now I also wanted to show you in the cold state. 
I'm gonna move these out of the way. It is similar to me to Boy's Tears from the very first Manny and Me box. And then our fleece reminded me of Python. So I wanted to compare those two for you. So this one, this one's the fleece, and then that one's the Python. And then again, our snow day and boys' tears. And there it is hot. And then hot and cold. All right, so let me know what y'all think, um, and if uh, you're not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Um, if you decide to make a purchase for Maniology, um, you can use my code LJMails10 for 10% off regular purchases. Unfortunately, it does not work for the Mani Buy Me boxes, but for any other regular priced item, it will work. All right. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate it and see you next time. Bye.